whoever drew up the fixture list deserves special credit for this weekend. It couldn't have been drawn any better. If Birmingham win, they go up automatically. If Reading win and Sheffield United don't, they return to the Premiership at the first attempt. The Modeski is packed to the rafters. It's a cracking atmosphere. It's a wonderful game to be played in perfect sunshine. Alex McLeish on the touchline and his counterpart, Steve Koppel, in the stands. Both tasted relegation 12 months ago. They want promotion this afternoon. Here's Jimmy Kebby. Nice ball inside. Might be a chance and distance. Well wide, but the first sighter of the afternoon for either club. Composed defending, he was outstanding in the win over Norwich City on Monday, which set up this finale. Might be a chance here from distance. Stings the palms of Mike Taylor. Jerome is on the prowl. As are three others, Carsley's there, as is Kevin Phillips. Hanneman was never too worried about that, though. McFadden with the corner. Oh, it's a good delivery. The American goalkeeper gets just enough, but McFadden pings it back in. Good pressure, this. It's Fahey from distance. It's crept in. It's the goal that could lead Birmingham City to the Premiership. Well, Hanneman is complaining, but it was his mistake. And those Blues fans behind the goal are in absolute ecstasy. If they win, they're up. And they have the lead. As you can see, it creeps under Hanneman. Perhaps his claim is that Jaidi was infringing his view, but Alex McLeish doesn't care. And nor the Birmingham City. They have the lead inside 20 minutes. Reading need something and need it quick. They must win today. Now they have to score at least two. Their home form has been so poor. Haven't won here since late January. Will that be the Achilles heel that ends their chances? Good effort across the face. It was Hunt that had it. McFadden to whip it in once more. Taylor and Jaidi go forward. Take it short, though. Now it goes into the box. It's not conclusive defending. Snapshot, really, in the end. Well, he's already scored once. He was looking for a second. Good break this from Birmingham City. He's got one left and one right. Might go all the way. He has now played it back to Phillips. Good save from Hanneman. And then cleared decisively. That was an opportunity, though. Hanneman makes up in some part for his mistake for the goal. Plenty in the box. It's Hunt's delivery. Normally a good one. Is again, that's a rasping effort. I think Taylor had it covered. Forward come Reading. And it goes to Shane Long, scored two on Monday. Can't find the back of the net this time, though. All the noise from the Birmingham section. They're still attacking. There's going to be a few nervy moments, you feel, between now and the end. Plenty of eyes on the... Events at Selhurst Park, but this is a chance for a second. And to wrap it up, it's Kevin Phillips. It's clinical as normal. And Birmingham City are on the very cusp of an immediate return to the big time. Lovely ball through. And when he gets in those positions, he rarely misses. Birmingham City have doubled their advantage in a game they knew if they won, they would be back in the Premiership. It's exactly what they're doing. And look what it means to everybody involved. Well, he just goes on and on, doesn't he? 14 for the season. Will he score a more important one? Probably not. Here's Kitson. Reading looking for something immediate. It's Matyowski. Makes good space. It's a lovely effort. Well, would you believe it? You never thought it was going to be that easy, did you, Birmingham City fans? And Reading have hope. Was he offside? Well, 
The referee in line from thought not so. It's irrelevant really. It's certainly a really lovely finish beyond Mike Taylor. Reading must score twice more. And Sheffield United have hope as well. What an afternoon this is turning out to be. Is there one or two? Final twist perhaps. Oh, good save, Taylor. And then he gets there. Now, did he bundle over the man? Howard Webb says no. Hanneman to thump it forward. It's do or die time. Might be a chance here for Shane Long. Well over and wide in the end. Dubry goes for the captain. What a time this would be to score a goal. Reading must find the back of the net. And immediately it's a chance. It's agonisingly wide. Doyle can't believe it. Birmingham break and relief pressure. It's O'Connor. A third and it's definitely over there. Fans can taste the premiership. Here's O'Connor. It's a wonderful one. Oh, off the post. That would have been brilliant. And that would have wrapped it up most perfectly. All eyes on Mr. Webb. Alex McLeish wants the final whistle. They knew if they came here and won, it would be an immediate return. It looks like that's exactly what they're going to do. 12 months ago, it was heartache and disappointment. Now it's joy and jubilation for the blue half of Birmingham. Kevin Phillips second was the crucial goal. Fahey got the first. And here at the Medeski, Birmingham City, their owner David Gold and their loyal bunch of fans will begin a party that will go on well into the night. Birmingham City are back in the big time for Reading. It's the playoffs. It's Manchester United, Arsenal, Liverpool and Chelsea at St Andrews. It's Birmingham City, Premiership bound.